All right, so uh, in this video, we will discuss how to generate random, random numbers in uh, LabVIEW. So to generate a random number in LabVIEW, uh, you have to go to this function. There is, in, in mathematics, numeric and random number 0, 1. And let me go ahead and show you that. So in the function block, you go to mathematics, uh, you go to num uh, numeric, and then it looks like a pair of uh, dice. So this is the random number generator right here. So you go ahead and you can put the random number. Okay. Now, uh, what number does it generate? Observe, it says number 0 to 1. So anytime you execute the program, it will generate a number between 0 and 1. Okay. And let me show you. Let me go ahead and put uh, a numeric indicator. All, that's all you need, basically. So let's say this is random number between 0 and 1. Okay. And then I'm just going to connect the output of this to here. That's it. So when I run this program, observe 0.997. Let's run it. Run it again, 0 0.42, 0 0.31, 0 0.50. So it will generate a random number between 0 and 1. So this is a random number generator, as simple as that. Now, if you have to uh, change the range of the random number generation, let's say you want to generate a random number between 0 and 10, what you're going to do? It's very simple. Since this thing generates random number between 0 and 1, if you want to go from 0 to 10, all you have to do is to multiply the output of this by 10, by the upper limit. So when it will generate 0, the output will be 0, 0 times 10. And when it will generate 1, the output will be 10, 1 times 10. And in between, it will generate all the numbers, any number between 0 and 10, including 0 and 10, right? If you have to generate only integers between 0 and 10, actually, that is this exercise, create a program that randomly generates an integer between 0 and 10. Front panel will contain only one element, which will be a numeric indicator, right? So basically, this is your front panel. And anytime you, you run it, run once, it should generate a number between uh, 0 and 10, and it should be only integer. That is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, only integers. So how are you going to do that? It's very easy. So first, what you're going to do, you're going to multiply the output by 10, as I discussed. Then it's going to generate number between 0 and 10, but it's not going to be integer. It's just going to be any number between 0 and 10, including 0 and 10. So how you are going to create integers? And for that, you have to round that off. Everyone know what round off means? But you are going to round that off. If you go to mathematics, numeric, then you will see round. You have round to the nearest round towards infinity, round towards positive infinity, round towards negative infinity. So you can just use round to nearest. And then you can put that round to nearest. The input to that round to nearest, round to nearest will be the, res the output of the uh, product block. And what product you're taking? You're taking the product of 10 and the output of this, right? so that your numbers can be generated between 0 and 10. So the output of that product block is going to go to round to nearest, which will round that output uh, for an integer value, the nearest integer value. And then that output is going to go to the numeric indicator. So then whenever you are going to click, run it once, it's going to show only numeric in integers between 0 and 10. right? So it is actually, I, I believe I explained it here. If you want to generate any number specific 0 to 10, all you have to do is to multiply the output of random number. OK, so that's a number, not integer, just a number. If you want output only random integers, instead of floating point, round them off to the closest integer using the appropriate function block that I showed you. Uh, that uh, you have three, three blocks. Uh, round to nearest, round towards negative infinity, round towards positive infinity. Just use round to nearest and it is going to generate an integer between 0 and 10. So this is basically exercise 10, and this is how you generate random integer 
and love you.